What's up guys, I'm here going to teach you how to jailbreak for 3.1.2 It's the latest firmware as of right now and it works for all devices um, But the iPod touch third generation is tethered. So every time you shut down your uh, iPod touch it will uh, Stay bricked unless you run the black rain again on your desktop and this is just for Windows only and uh, It's pretty easy just a couple of steps and uh, if, if you have the iPhone 3G, you're gonna have a lot of trouble, but we'll talk about that later. First thing you gotta do is just update to 3.1.2. If you're already updated, then just restore. So I'm just gonna go through the process of updating myself. Okay, once you're up to date in 3.1.2, you're gonna have to download Black Rain, which I'm gonna put in the description. So what you do is just double click, run, and you'll get this little uh, small window. And what you gotta do is just, uh, hold on. What you gotta do is connect your iPhone to the computer or iPod Touch, either way. And um, either turn iTunes on or off, it doesn't really matter. And uh, just press make it rain, and it should go into entering recovery mode, and your iPhone should be turning off it should it should show the Apple uh, symbol and the iTunes to USB logo now as for the iPhone 3G users such as myself there seems to be an issue every time you try to make it rain the little uh, jailbreak here it will just stay stuck on running and your iPhone will be just stuck on the iTunes and the USB logo for like as long as you want but it will not let you jailbreak and the way I did it was that I um, turned off my iPhone and turned it back on after I took out everything. And um, it took me about 10 tries or more. I, I, learned, I lost count because I was trying too much. But it took me about 10 tries. The only windows that were up was Firefox and Make It Rain. So if that had any helps, turn iTunes off. The version of iTunes I'm using is 9.0.1 and uh, I did not run as administrator on my Windows Home Premium 32-bit. That's pretty much all I can say on how it must have worked because I don't know why it worked. It worked for me twice but I got ignorant enough to turn it off as soon as it said it worked. But after that it did work again so I'm thinking if you turn off iTunes off, if you take down all the windows up like all the windows they have up then it should work flawlessly and you gotta turn it off and turn it back on and see how it goes guys and that's pretty much how you jailbreak for 3.1.2 Cydia does work you get to choose if you want to get icy or rock they're pretty much the same as Cydia but I prefer Cydia better and winterboard does work and if you want to unlock you should not do this jailbreak you should wait until the uh, official release Mac users, you're going to have to wait for uh, Jailbreak 2. And uh, that's all you got to know, guys.